cool guys. Thanks for watching. And uh, today in this video, we're going to be continuing our build on our Traxxas TRX-4 Ultimate Crawler. Um, very happy to be in this wonderful little facility here. Thank you, my friend let me use his uh, little place here. Excellent. We call it the wrench pit. This place is really awesome. Very happy to be able to use it. So, if you've seen in my last video, I picked up a TRX-4 with the intent of making it really the ultimate crawler, in my opinion, for what I want to do. And I'm going to be putting on a few nice little brass goodies. there it is all put together the truck is on right now but you can see how good that looks pretty nice easy to do too also made some fender wells in there it looks stupid like this but with the body on it covers it all up and look who showed up hey what's up everybody alan and george the other two crawler nuts we all have trx fours Relatively recent purchases. Alan's bolting on a few upgrades. What do you got going on here, Alan? So right now I'm adding on some of the STRC brass uh, front end pieces, the outdrives, uh, steering knuckles, add a little weight to the front end here. Uh, so I just got that done. Uh, we got the Proline Scaler shocks with the dual rate on them. It's got a definitely a lot smoother feel than the original. And I just uh, switched out the uh, motor that's made for a Traxxas Rustler over to a uh, 45 turn rock crawler motor and we're going to see how that compares. Uh, that's And we've got a heavier dirty duty servo in this one uh, and that's her mods right now and we'll see how it compares in a few minutes with the other trucks. Awesome. George, what kind of mods you got on your old beast over here? Not too much, actually, Scott. We're just in the beginning. I got a... Uh, what? No mods? <laughs> no, what is a, this? Just a few, just in the beginning. <laughs> I got an 8mm uh, hub extension on the wheels, and basically right now just move the battery pack up front to add some more weight. And here is my Proline body, all painted up, guys. So I painted it black and gold uh, just because that brass uh, influenced the paint job a little blit, bit. Blit. <laughs> Use the, the, the mask that the body comes with and kind of plasti dip the external parts like the fenders and the grill to give it a different look. This is Alan's custom body. He got the, uh, I guess it's a 47 power wagon. Um, and it, man, he did a great job on the paint. Came out really good. Very unique color, very vintage looking. Unfortunately, he's having some problems getting it to sit on the Traxxas as far as mounting it. It's very skinny body, so a little bit of an issue, but he's going to work it out, and if not, he'll sell it. I'm sure he'll be able to get pretty good money for that thing. And uh, we want to play now. This is the pulling event. 
This is where Alan gets his ass kicked in the tug of war. Tug of war competition, old school, on the carpet, like you were 12 years old. Stock motor, 45 turn RC four wheel drive motor. What is the difference? We already know that that is a slower car, probably more torque. But I'm going to give the count. Ready, gentlemen. Ready. Three, two, one. Pull. Wow. The 45 turn motor, not even close. All right, one more. Gentlemen, are you ready? Ready. Round two. Three, two, one. Pull. Oh, Again. Oh, tire off the car. Oh, the axle drop on the ground. The axle slam. <laughs> yes, sir. Victory. This is where placer racing actually gets a win this evening. So here we go. We are going to do towing competition on three to see who is going to take round two. On three, two, one, go. Oh, Alan Placer taking the win once Back again. Up, Not only does Alan take the win, but Scott's TRX4 ends up going high side and flips over and Alan toes him to the wall. This is supposed to be the ultimate crawler. All right, ready? Okay, so now we're talking round two of event two. On three, two, one, go. Oh my goodness. Alan Placer wow. has now yeah. gotten into crawling officially. Wow. A scale is no longer his achievement. It is now going to be 10 scale crawling. Three, two, one. Torture. Oh. That was more of a no when to let off. Huh? Another victory for the smaller motor. Three. Two, one, go! Not going through that yeah, right. now. The high torque motor, again. Wow. Right, let's do front to rear. <laughs> Three, two, one, go! Holy shit! <laughs> Oh my god. So here we go. On three, two, one, go. Yes. The Bronco has been defeated. If the ball goes to the right and touches that wall, the Punisher Black Truck scores a goal. If the ball goes over here to this wall, then the Bronco team scores a goal. So on zero, we're going to go. Three, two, one, go. Oh. oh, there's a deadlock in the corner. Oh, Punisher's up. Bronco's over to the side. <laughs> Technically, that is a Bronco Gore Skull. This is a continuation of that round two in which Punisher had been removed. The Punisher has, been <laughs> the Punisher has now been inflicted Some with a wound. Case. There is a sunglass case bumper remnant on the floor. This is round three. Right now it is round one to Punisher, the black truck. Round two to Bronco, red and black. This is round three. On three, two, one, and go. Some more control this time at the start. Punisher's making his move. All right, so Punisher is out because Punisher is being punished. And... Now it's George versus Alan, both the, looking the same, but Alan, of course, has the better motor, which we've already proven tonight. I'm going to start it off. Three, two, one, go. George with the early aid coming to bumper to bumper, battling together. George getting the upper hand. Almost there. No. Hits the wall. That is a point. It didn't hit the that wall. Is, it didn't hit the wall? It did not hit the wall. Oh, I thought it did. No, Let's go to instant back. replay. There. No. Hits the wall. 
out. It has been determined that it did not it did not hit the wall. That is one point for Mr. Placer. Again, dominating the this procedure. Round two. Three, two, one, go. Oh. Oh boy. Both of the drivers try and do their best to maneuver the drivetrain. And another point for Mr. Placer. He is dominating at his own arena. <laughs> I'll take one more. I'll take one. Last round. Alan, I will give it to you. Uh, we gotta make medals for this. You shit. are blowing your Last round. Round three. Two, one, and push. Can George get some kind of score going? Or is Alan going to dominate? Alan flips. Flips his truck back over. And Alan flips again, but the ball is in the way. Oh, this looks like it's going to George. It gets out of the way. Nope. Out of bounds. You just can't use your body Here's the rule for the next round. You have to start a foot away from the ball. All right, perfect. Ready, three, two, one, go. Oh! <laughs> no, Curtis, oh. oh no! Oh no! That's it. That's it. That's it. Uh, Game over. over the Alright guys. Thanks for watching. Appreciate it. Had a good time tonight. Subscribe if you like. Always someone else to do in the winter. Always more videos to come. We have lots more stuff that we're doing to our uh, TRX4s, so if you're into it, watch. Thanks.